Welcome to Choose Your Orgone Pyramid Game. TheMoonTree.org, intuitive living for a magical life. Okay, so if you picked red, red pyramid. So, you are definitely seeking some... Um, root chakra healing so look up red root chakra start thinking red eating red red essential oils things that come from a root anything you can think of that comes from a root whether that's essential oils or root chakra vegetables like beets carrots potatoes especially red potatoes red beets that you know you get double whammy red right so that you're looking for stability security a feeling of you know, on solid ground. So that's another thing you can do if there's no snow on the ground. Walk barefoot for five minutes, even if it's a little bit cold still out there because it's just spring here in Canada. But get out there on your bare feet. That's why they call it the ground because it actually does ground you. So yes, do that. Now, let's take a quick peek at your Lenormand Oracle cards for you that you picked the red stability root chakra as well as this stuff can go a lot with um blood pressure blood circulation that red blood you know anything but below your lower back um your, your tailbone anything below that all of that ankles knees you know that too feet and again here we've got um health issues here again so we've got the uh tree here so we do have some health and it's talking about getting into groups of people to learn more about your health so um facebook groups for example or new kind of groups about certain books maybe you've seen some anthony williams stuff lately with the uh cleaning your liver and all that kind of stuff he's awesome by the way anthony williams check it out the celery juice protocol mm -hmm. but anyways uh this is definitely talking about your health again so um get into these guard this is the garden like in the olden days where they gathered into groups and they discussed about um stuff and you know what's funny is the tree is also a symbol of stability and security so that goes again with that red root chakra the stability and security of being rooted look at roots <laughs> look at that stuff and you'll be just fine so uh yeah focusing on the red root chakra for this month and uh everything's gonna be great okay see you soon at www.themoontree.org stay tuned for the next reading okay so if you picked number two this is tree agate perfect stone for meditation so you've maybe be coming into your spiritual journey where you're learning to do a lot of meditation which is perfect that's great we all need meditation prayer all the quieting of the mind shutting off all the ego shutting off all the chatter of the day shutting off the chattery opinions of others which leads me into my next thing you are probably enjoying the outdoors right now and actually walking through the trees walking through the forest and if you're not you should be you should be getting grounded with those trees this is such it's named tree agate for a reason because it is just like walking through a beautiful forest and getting that meditation that calm that beauty there so now heart chakra we're talking about giving and receiving love compassion getting some more green into your life spirulina green smoothies juicing blah 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 adding a few more greens getting out looking at green grass looking at green trees you know getting that color frequency in all that kind of stuff so definitely heart chakra green we're talking here and for the lenorma let's see what they have to say because you picked this color you picked this particular pyramid the tree agate orgone pyramid so let's see what's going on with the lenorma 
got one last card for you here. Already we're seeing here talking about your true north, your compass. Where am I going in life? Is this the right path? You're just contemplating, you know, am I feeling good? Sort of like taking an inventory of what's feeling good, what's not, what's my true north, what's feeling good. You know, what are my hopes and dreams? What's my stars and all that? That goes very much together, you know, like you're looking in your heart for your compass, which is great. And heart totally resonates with this uh, green, you know, tree, agate, pyramid green green heart chakra going with your heart going with your true hopes and dreams you know what's your true compass and the you know you may have been arguing about it with a spouse or with a partner with somebody in your family you may have been sort of debating back and forth about that maybe they don't quite agree with your true north or something like that but you know what it doesn't matter it's what feels right to you this is your life your video game your thing it's nobody else's so you know take with their information with a grain of salt say thank you i appreciate your opinion you know it means a lot to me it really does but I'm going to be following my true north. I'm going to be following what makes me happy because this is my journey. This is my experience. This is why I came on earth in the first place. So I'm going to do that. And so you're going to be very happy. So this pyramid is for sale still. Uh, I only make one of a kind. So once it's gone, it's gone. But I love you very much. And we'll see you next time. Bye for now. So you picked angelite. The stone of angelic communication, communication with the divine. You know what angelite is? It's smooshed up celestite over millions of years. That's smooshed up into this beautiful little robin's egg. You know, I am a fan of angelite. I love it. And I find it just amazing how it's actually celestite that's all crushed into these beautiful, beautiful angelic stones. So good for you for picking and enjoy. You're probably going through a time of spiritual awareness, talking to the divine, maybe seeking mediumship, all sorts of stuff like that. Um, you're really interested in communicating with your guardian angels, your angels, and your loved ones who have passed. So I do offer mediumship readings on my website, www.themoontree.org, as well as this pyramid. And I only make one of a kind, so once it's gone, it's gone. Now, let's talk about what is in store for you based on the fact that you picked the Angel Light Pyramid. Okay. So, so far what I see is there is definitely some movement, some positive sudden changes in your life. It's this upward movement and it, it's due to you know, it could, this could be a, these owls can be a partnership, but a lot of times these owls for me mean uh, wise communication, intuitive communication, special communication. It's not those rumors on Facebook or the rumors at the office or those kind of chatty, chatty, McChatster, hens in the hen house kind of talk. This is wise learning, discovery, communication. That's what the owls signify here in the Cyril Marshalli um, Lenormand deck. And so here we've got the storks and that's you rising promoting higher levels like the stork right and storks always come back every year to the same place you know they migrate but then they always come back so this is about you know a sudden change right now but know that it's always going to come back you're always going to come back to what's true to you to what's natural to you and to what you enjoy and through wise communication you can do that now i wanted to say one more thing there is perhaps a little bit of health issues right now that you're going through and i feel because the tree can mean ancestral roots where you're feeling rooted right now so there's two things going on here one is the feeling of being rooted somewhere and perhaps there's some changes, sudden changes in your life with the stork that's making you feel a little bit uneasy about where you should be in life or where you should be physically, your locale even. It could be where you live. It could be anything like that. Uh, family issues, stuff like that. But a lot of times this tree also means health. So really look at, make sure your health is good too and make sure you get that wise communication from professionals homeopathic doctors coming to me right now homeopathic doctor a good one that does blood testing tests your blood and shows you on the screen on the video screen what's going in and watching your blood cells do its thing 
and I want you to find a homeopathic doctor like that. That's mine and it's awesome. It is so amazing seeing your cells on screen doing their thing. And I really think that that is a good thing for you to start thinking about that. Things, what are you allergic to food wise? It's causing you inflammation, you know, things like that. So that's gonna be helpful as well as there is some sudden changes coming as well. But the Angel Light Pyramid definitely is here to help you and to really capture the divine messages those downloads the intuitive guidance from the heavens your angels all that especially your angels uh because this is called angel light so yes okay thank you for joining me and i'll see you soon at www.themoontree.org bye for now so you picked dalmatian stone commonly confused with the word dalmatian jasper this is not a jasper these are not jaspers. It's called Dalmatian stone. Isn't that interesting? You learned something new today. Now, why did you pick this? Well, number one, you're needing a little more playfulness in your life or you're feeling playful lately. Now, Dalmatian stone resonates very well with animals and children because it's such an uplifting, playful, hee hee, like I totally feel like just laughing and going to the park and all these childlike sort of going on the swings really high, that kind of stuff that comes to mind when you hold the Dalmatian Jasper. It's very playful and cute and, and, and that. And it's kind of nostalgic too. You'll start thinking about your past and everything that's happened in your life in, in good ways too. You know, it's good memories and stuff like that. So Dalmatian stone. Now, what's in store for you based on this pick? By the way, the Dalmatian Stone Orgone Pyramid is for sale at my site, www.themoontree.org. And now, I only make one of a kind. They're all unique, so get it while you can. Okay, what do we have in store for you? Okay, there's some kind of mask involved. It could be someone else, it could be yourself. It could be you not showing your true colors for some reason, you're holding your cards, you're masking yourself for some reason, or it could be someone else masking yourself. And there is a sudden change in the midst. So the masking equals or comes into this sudden change because that's what the storks are. There's a movement, a promotion, a change. Now, you really want to look at it carefully. So if this is going on at work, maybe you're in a hiring position, you're hiring someone and they look really, really good, but under the mask, there's some changes, um, you know, you're a little bit iffy. Go with your intuition, okay, if you're, if you're trying to hire someone. Now, that's what I want to say for everybody going through this kind of situation. Whatever this situation is that is promising some kind of promotion, that up level, sudden change, right? It's promising that but there is a mask involved. It really needs a lot of look, that magnifying glass, look at all the details. What's going on here, right? Let's let's take a really, really good, closer look at this, okay? Let's really, really take a good look. Okay, yes, okay. You know, get the details, get all that, and then in the meantime, follow your little playfulness, have some fun in life, don't be so serious, right? This is a very big sign about not being too serious either. So whatever this situation is, Think like a kid with Dalmatian stone or Pyramid. All right, see you soon. Bye for now.